Today I have two 60 volt power tool batteries made by two different manufacturers. One is made by Greenworks and the other one is made by Snapper which is a uh, bricks and strap company. So these are two totally different manufacturers yet the batteries are almost identical except the labels and sticker on them. They look almost identical. So today I want to find out whether or not they are interchangeable with each other. I'm going to try to use a charger from one brand to charge a battery from the other brand and vice versa to see if they are compatible with each other. I'm going to do the same thing on the tool. So I'm going to try the uh, snapper battery on the green work tool and vice versa to see if they are compatible. So let's get started. If you follow my channel and watch my other videos previously, uh, you probably know that I use this battery not for my tool but for my uh, electric scooter. So I make this connector here and I just hook it up to the terminals and voila I can connect this to my electric scooter and it will run my electric scooter just fine. Now if you take a look at the terminals on both batteries you can see that they are actually identical. Plus C and this sign look like Omega or something and that is negative and if I take this connector here and connect to the Greenworks battery it will fit in here perfectly just like when I connect in the snapper battery so both batteries are almost identical except one thing each have a couple of braille's on the side here and this will allow you to slide in the charger or the tool but there is a little difference in the rails you can see the top rails are the same on both batteries but the bottom rail is a little bit different the top rails are the same the bottom rails on the green works it's smaller on the snapper bricks and stratton battery it's bigger and it's lower on the bottom way down here instead of up here so now you take a green works battery and try to slide in a snapper battery it doesn't go in it's got stuck right here and over here I have a snapper battery trying to slide in the green works charger and it does not go in and the same thing applies for the tools so they are not interchangeable as far as sliding the battery in the tool or the, the charger. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and remove the plastic housing on the outside here. So I remove the four screws on each battery and I'm just going to pull it out. Now I'm going to connect the Greenworks battery to the snapper charger. Let's see if it works and nothing happens but if you look at the charger itself there is a button right on the bottom here and I believe that is a switch see that that's an activating switch so when the battery still has a casing when you push it in it will be pressed on this switch and I guess that will allow the charger to recognize that there's a battery being inserted in. So when I remove the outer plastic casing, it is thinner. So when I insert the battery, it does not reach that switch down there. So that it doesn't turn on the charger. So now if I just try and um, push it all the way down to the bottom first, before I push it in, you hear that click that's when it's depressing the button down there and will turn on the relay you hear that relay click right after I press that button down there and now you see it's charging the battery so my next test is to use a snapper battery onto a Greenworks charger there is a little difference here on the Greenworks charger is that the button down here it's a little bit smaller so when I push the battery all the way in 
it does not reach that button and activate that button down there. So what I gotta do is to use a screwdriver and push down on the button to activate it. There we go. You hit a relay click and it's charging. Now you can see the voltage is increasing. There we go, it's working great. The moment I release this button, it immediately turned off and stopped charging. Now that we know the batteries and chargers are compatible between the two brands, next thing I want to know is whether or not I can use this snapper battery on the Greenworks power tool. So this is the 60 volt Greenworks blower. Let's try and put it in. It fit in here just fine without the case, but if I have the case, it wouldn't fit in there. So let's try push this in. Okay. Goes in just fine. Okay. Now let's turn it on. Works. Here we go. So it works just fine. Now I want to use the snapper battery on the green works plastic case. So it fits in here. Fits in here just fine. Now I can slide it in the green works tool just fine. Just like that. It goes in smoothly. And it locks in. See if it works. There we go. Now I don't have a snapper tool to try the green works battery on uh, because I use the uh, snapper battery on my electric scooter. I don't have a snapper tool. But according to my last test, if I put this green works battery to a snapper tool, it will be the same. It should work just fine. But if you want to interchange the batteries with the tools, I guess you can modify the slots here, the plastic slots here. So you can cut the plastic slots on the bottom here. The tops are the same, by the way. The bottoms are different. So you can cut the plastic slots on the bottom here. You can use a saw, a router, um, and cut out the plastic here and make them the same and put back to the batteries they should be compatible and that's all I have for now folks hopefully it will help somebody with mismatched power tools and batteries and chargers all right see you next time